Yeah, the year's been good. It's been uh, it's been eventful, but overall, it's been good. <laughs> Issues in like in Rotorua, I had a puncture, and in Tasmania, I had a couple of crashes that cost me a lot of time. And I didn't need to uh, give away, and then Madeira was, was spot on. Like it was a good weekend, just kept it clean, consistent. Wild race, there's still two stages to go, but still a lot of racing to go, so just try to keep staying on top of things. I won it! You I fucking won it! Yeah, it's been a big goal of mine to try win one outside of Ireland, as you say, to not, not be that guy, so to get one in Madeira was amazing. I like, it was kind of cool because it was a real testing race, like it did test every ability, so it felt like a really good one to win. So Klaus and the Cube guys have really spoiled me this weekend. They've gone to big lengths to get a custom frame here. And yeah, I've just seen it a few minutes ago and it looks amazing, like the shine off it is just unreal. And yeah, like whenever you're a kid and you look at magazines and stuff and you see something custom, you're like, wow, that's the dream. Like just to get a one-off thing just for you is, yeah, that is literally the dream. So to have one now that I can call my own is just phenomenal, it's amazing. The Irish are notorious for getting behind their own whenever there's a bit of sporting success going on. And to be able to feel that firsthand at a home race, like when I race an Irish race, or even when I go training, you know, I can just see how much support everyone has for me. But then this weekend is just, it's ridiculous, like the people get so behind it and I just feel so much support. Yeah, it's easy to say, yeah, there is pressure there, definitely. People keep reminding me about it as well. <laughs> But it's not, like, I don't really see it as pressure because everyone who wants me to do well just wants me to do well. It's just positive energy, you know, they're only wishing me the best. Yeah, at the end of the day, just control the controllables, so just focus on riding my bike as fast as I can. If that's good enough to win, brilliant. If it's not, it's still gonna be a good day out on the bike. Yeah, I think the big thing in Ireland is the intensity, really. Like, the tracks are a little shorter, but there's just no let up, there's no room to relax. You're always pumping or pedaling or pushing into a corner or something, like you just can't relax. There's not much margin for error, and because it's that intense, it's just everyone's just on the limit all day, so. Although it's probably going to go into shorter race times, it's still going to be one of the tougher races just to be that, that aggressive, that precise and hold it all together for six stages. Racing Arnold every year is a massive highlight for me. I look forward to it so much. The crowd there is just incredible and the support they gave this year was even bigger and better than ever before. So to come away from that race with the series lead and experience that kind of home support was just incredible and I couldn't ask for much more. Really looking forward now to getting out to France and continuing on the series of the next few races.